watching this from any part of the world, you're probably in some form of lockdown or uh, the other. As we stay indoors or practice social distancing, some in Japan are using this time to drink at home. A new virtual drinking party has become a sensational hit in Japan. Our next report has more. We've all heard of Zoom meetings to discuss office work. We've even heard of video calls to catch up with family. Some of us have even indulged in a game of house with our loved ones across the world. The lockdown has inspired creativity in most of us. But in Japan, there is a different kind of a virtual gathering which is gaining momentum. Online drinking parties have become popular. After the Japanese government urged people to stay at home to curb virus transmission, this virtual service called Stacknom translates to drink at home and users can simply enter a video chat room, raise a toast and take a swig of their favorite drink together. This service has attracted around 2.4 million users in the two months since its inception. Japan has recorded more than 15,900 COVID-19 cases with 657 deaths so far due to the infection. Bars and pubs have been shut across the country to curb the infection and discourage mass gatherings. And so, the people of Japan have now turned to virtual drinking parties. These parties, known as nomikai, are considered by many Japanese as essential to building strong bonds between friends and colleagues. This 35-year-old school teacher has taken full advantage of the online drinking service. She has even dressed up to the nines, almost as if she were heading out for a night out with her friends. My meeting party was initially planned at a karaoke parlor, but all of them are closed now, so I had to cancel. I was looking for another way to interact with people and I found Techno. I thought it would allow us to communicate, so that's why I decided to use it and organize this event. The drinking service, Tacnom, is operated by a startup called Tenten Incorporated with only five part time employees. And now it is gaining popularity in the face of the state of emergency imposed in Japan, which is likely to continue till the end of May. I hope our service can help users meet people they cannot see right now. I would be very happy if their time at home, due to self restraint from going out, will be enriched. The virtual platform requires no downloads or registrations. Users are required to create a URL and share the same with their friends. They can then join virtual gatherings of up to 12 people. Bureau Report, We On, World is One.